up YouTube, it's me. I'm coming at y'all today, first of all, to formally um, apologize for not having posted a video um, over two months. The reason for that is because I had a lot of um, papers and things that I had to do in order to finish up my first year of college. So I'm finally done with that. And, um, yeah, as you guys can tell, my hair is really short, and the reason why it's really short is because I had decided to do the big chop. So, I just recently did it a few days ago, and I'm absolutely loving it. I cannot really tell <laughs> what my hair texture is, but, um... I just know that from doing a big chop, I have very low maintenance of my hair. Um, it's a lot easier to deal with. And, um, you know, it's just been great. And I've been able to embrace my natural uh, hair, you know. And I really did want to donate my hair. So, I'm thinking about doing it. If I can't find uh, a close organization, then... I guess I will just throw it away. But anyway, um, yeah, this this video is gonna be about how I am, you know, currently transitioning, and um, you know, how I deep condition my hair, you know, and just the things that I do just to define my curl pattern. So let me just start off by saying that um. Just here um, last week, I did my first online purchase, and I did it from Amazon. And the thing that I decided to purchase was the Jamaican Black Castor Oil. This is an 8-ounce bottle. I got that for $13. And I'm pretty sure you guys know, um, you know about this product already, but I just want to show you guys the consistency. So I'm just going to dip my finger in. And you can see that it's pretty thick. Okay. But let me get into the um, ingredients that I use for my hair. Okay. That feels good. Okay. So the first thing that I use um, is my Olive Extra Premium um, Oil, which contains the canola oil, extra virgin olive oil, and grapeseed oil. Um, and that is just part of my oil regimen. And the second thing that I use for my oil regimen is the Jamaican Black Castor Oil. So I just take those two products and I always massage it into my scalp. Just give myself a really good massage for about a minute or two to get the blood circulated. But when it comes down to my um, deep conditioning or just wash and go, whatever, um, I will be using my Herbal Essence Body Envy Shampoo Conditioner. You guys know that I have had this for um, maybe about a year now. I'm not even sure, but I know I had it for a while. So I'll be using that. Um, I'll be using my Rockin' Argan Oil Conditioner. I also had this for a while. And I'm almost up. And lastly, to really help define my curls, I don't know why, but this Suave um, Almond and Shea Butter Conditioner works so well. It's 100% natural. And I just love how it smells. So basically, um, just to now wrap up the fact that you guys know what I use um to do my deep conditioning today. I'm going to be using a uh, egg white, and this is just leftover from when I did my egg mask this morning. So I'm not going to use like a whole egg. I'm just going to use what's left. And I'm going to put that in my hair and let it set for about uh, five to ten minutes, and then um I'll rinse that out. Then I'll go ahead and show you guys what I do for um, my watch and go. So this, again, is going to be for um, the deep conditioning process. I'm just going to use the egg and that's it. 
So I'm just going to actually show you guys how to do this on a camera. So first thing that I do is I'm going to wet my hair and then I'm going to apply it. Okay, you guys. So I am back. Um, so I just um, wet my hair. And as you can see, sorry, the water is um, kind of dripping. So my hair is completely wet. Alright. So now I'm just going to take the egg white. And I'm going to apply that to my hair. Don't put that in my hand. It's a little cold. 